Good morning everyone, it is 20 to 9. I've been up for about an hour but just been snoozing on and off. Um, I'm debating what to do today because it's currently raining. So I think I still might go to Castle Combe, Coombe, Castle Combe, Castle Coombe, um, and try and battle the rain. I've got a raincoat and an umbrella so we will see. But it's about an hour's drive each way so yeah. We will see. If it gets heavier, I don't think I'm going to go because I don't really like driving in the rain. But at the moment, it's quite light rain, so it should be okay. So yeah, I'm going to have a cup of tea, um, make some breakfast, make a sandwich for lunch, and then get dressed and head off. So I'm all changed now. I've gone for a long sleeve jumper and some jeans. I've got another jumper with me. I'm also going to pack a dress um, in the car just in case it gets warmer because then I can just find a toilet and change um because i don't know because it's an hour away the weather could be completely different but at the moment it's pretty gray so i've gone for this for now and then if it gets warm i've got a dress so yeah i've got my cup of tea i'm just drinking that i'm gonna have some fruit and yogurt for breakfast um uh, make my sandwich and then i'm gonna leave i'm not in kind of any rush to leave um probably gonna leave around about 10 ish um and get there for about 11 so yeah that is my plan this morning i've taken a detour so we've actually come to crinchester i think and that's what it's called um because i looked up castle Combe and it's like a tiny village and it's an hour away and i just thought i don't really want to drive an hour away in the rain get there spend like half an hour there and then drive an hour back so i thought i'd come here because it's a bigger town and there's like things to look at and yeah that's what i'm going to do today instead i've just come inside this shopping center and then i'm going to walk through um but yeah no very nice in here they've got like all different shops i mean hopefully you can hear me because i've got a mask on but yeah i'm just gonna have a look around and see what shops they have i think i'm gonna find somewhere to have a cup of tea um and then head and have something to eat as well because i'm not eating breakfast so that'd be quite nice to have something um to eat walking down a side alley i just went to um cafe and this is they have really cute shops here so i'm gonna have a look in some of them but yeah i just went to a cafe had a tea and a croissant um and i'm gonna see what other shops they have down the little passages because i think there's a few gifts that i'd quite like to get for family and friends and also i want to go to the bakery because my friend told me to get um a cake that has like currants in um and like sugar so yeah i'm gonna try and find somewhere for that but it's so cute here and they have like little lights and it's just like yeah really really cute here so I definitely recommend it it does have like a bigger high street but yeah i love the little side passages which is so cute I've just been wandering around the town. So the town centre is like down here. And then you've got, um, I don't really know what this area is, but it's just very cute. And look at these hedges, they're huge. So that must be maybe like a big house or manor or something like that. But yeah, very cute. So I'm gonna go and walk back into town. You can see the church is there. So let's go and have a look at that. This is the main kind of like centre bit, I guess. And you've got the church. Um, and then all the shops so yeah gonna have a look around the shops and see if there's anywhere else we can walk but yeah the church is very very pretty um, and they've got lots of little shops I'm also on the lookout for a bakery so when I find a bakery I'm gonna try and get some of the cakes that my friends told me to get so if you go on the other side you can see kind of all of the shops so this is on the other side again very quaint and um yeah really really pretty and a lot quieter here which is nice this is the other side of the church cathedral i was like over there um, I'm going to walk down here now and look at the shops because I've already looked at the shops um, behind me. So yeah, I'm going to see what else um, there is. As you can see, it's not that busy here, which is great. Um, whereas Borton on the Water was like so, so busy. So this is, yeah, this is a very nice change and definitely going to have a look at the shops down there. Looking on outside of the cathedral church and you can see up here, it's got like 
faces in the stonework which is quite interesting to see but yeah no it's very intricate um i think i'm gonna have a look inside because i like to look inside these type of places um yeah so let's go in and have a look These are the little shops. I love the little colours above them. I just think they just make it pop. Yeah, so it's very lovely here. Um, so I'm going to have a look and see if there's any that I want to go in. I don't think so, but just seeing I'm on the hunt for a baker's at the moment. Let's come inside a little shopping arcade, which is really cute. And they have lots of shops in here. So I'm going to have a quick look around um, and see what there is. I just think it's so cute in here, like everywhere, they just have lots of cute shops. I think they have a market as well, so I'll try and show you that if I can. I just got back in the car. I think I'm going to head back and just rest for the afternoon because I'm pretty tired. Um, and then tomorrow I'm going to visit another little town slash village in the morning and again just rest in the afternoon. And then Friday I have to check out a tent so I'll drive home. So yeah, I think that's it. I think I've spent a really nice time here. I've seen kind of as much as I can. Um, I'm going to go back, have lunch and just relax for the afternoon. Just got back. I'm going to have my lunch now. It is about half past 12 I think have lunch and then i'm actually going to walk down there's a cafe down there i'm going to walk down there and use their um wi-fi and try and get a blog post up and a video up so yeah that's what i'm going to do for the rest of the afternoon because it looks like it's going to rain um so it'd be nice to have a nice walk and yeah i will keep you updated when i was out today i picked up a mug i just thought it was really cute and it's got an a on it and then i picked up some lardy cake which my friend told me to get because she's from around here so it's basically currants um bread i think or cake and it's got like sugar in between so that'd be really nice um after my lunch then i got these for my nephews so one is pickup sticks and one is tiddy winks and they're kind of like old-fashioned games so i thought it'd be fun for them to play yes yeah, so that's what i picked up today for lunch today i have a ham and cheese sandwich again uh crisps and an apple i think i might have some olives as well because they're in the fridge um so yeah that is my lunch Hey Ron, this is like an awful angle, but it's the only way I could film it. I'm going to try this lardy cake, so I thought I would try it on camera. So it's basically cake with currants and sugar. So let's give it a go. Mmm, very nice. It kind of reminds me of a really sweet hot cross bun, and it would be really, really good with a hot cup of tea. So I'm going to do that right now. It finally got to pick the donkey. Lovely donkey. Aren't you? Lovely. Yeah. And then the other one is not so sure about the rain. So, yeah. how cute. So, as you can see, I've got my bubble hat on because it's raining. But I've just walked down this path here. So, the pods are kind of here and the, sh the kind of animals are up there. So, I'm just walking down here and the sheep are in here. And I'm going to go past the, these are where like the other accommodation is. Um, so I'm going to go down and to the Nut Grove, I think. I'm going to walk to the little cafe, which is called the Nuttery, I think, in Knot Grove. So I'm actually staying in Knot Grove, which is a little village. Um, and yeah, it's just so cute, so quaint. Um, and it's really easy to walk there. It's about a four minute walk. So yeah, I'm going to go there now. And it's raining, so excuse me if the camera gets a bit wet. But I'll show you what it looks like. And you've got kind of like houses. And then the cafe is that way, I think. So I'm going to take a shortcut and go up here just because I don't need to go all the way around there. But yeah, it's pretty raining now, but it's very quiet here and very peaceful. So I really, really like it. So this is where I was just at. So this is called the Nuttery and it's got a little cafe in here um, and there's outdoor space as well. And then this is kind of like the rest of the village here. So yeah, it's very cute. I think I'm going to come back tomorrow um and spend more time on my laptop 
I'm back in my little hut. I have tied my hair up, I've got my comfies on, and yeah, just gonna watch some TV, read some of my book, maybe have a nap. <laughs> um, I'm gonna have a cup of tea as well. But it was good just to go down there and do a few things on my laptop because the Wi Fi is really good. So I'm gonna go back tomorrow. I managed to upload a video, so I'm gonna try and upload a blog post tomorrow. And yeah, but now I'm kind of ready for the evening. Um, I'm gonna have the leftover stir fry for dinner. Um, and yeah, just relax really, cause I am so knackered. I don't know why, but why is glamping make you so knackered? I think it's cause you're like outdoors and you're doing quite a lot outdoors um, and a lot of walking and things like that. But yeah, no, really enjoyed today. Um, Crinchester, Sinchester was a really lovely place and I really love the shops um, and it just had such a lovely feel to it so yeah I'm very happy that I went there. So I've just made myself a hot chocolate with the packets I got and I'm using the marshmallows seeing as I'm probably not going to do the fire outside because it's pretty cold at the moment um, and then I'm going to have some rest of the lardy and read my book. I've put the heater on as well because it's pretty cold so yeah very very happy. It is pouring outside. I don't think the camera is going to pick it up, but it's raining a lot. So I'm glad that I'm inside um, in the warm because <laughs> it looks pretty cold out there and pretty wet and rainy. It is 10.7. I'm just cooking my dinner. I'm just having the leftover stir fry because obviously I don't want to waste it. Um, yeah, that's my dinner. And then for pudding, I don't know what I'm going to have yet, but I've got a choice of creme caramel. I've got cupcakes i've got mars bars i've got so much stuff so yeah definitely got a lot to choose from for dessert so just checking in i've put my well you can't really see i've put my pajamas on um and a lot of jumpers because it's kind of cold tonight i sprung over the duvet because my blanket is not warm enough so that's what i've done got a lovely cup of tea there had a cupcake i'm gonna have another cupcake and yeah, just watching some TV, gonna read a bit of my bed, my bed, read a bit of my book before bed. And yeah, try and get like an early night. I'll probably go to bed about 10 ish, which is what I've been doing every night actually, and waking up about eight, nine. So it's not too bad. Um, and it's raining. So I feel like if it rains heavily, it's gonna be quite noisy tonight. So that's gonna be interesting. Um, not sure what I'm gonna do tomorrow yet. It just depends on the weather. Um, I think I might try and go into Burford, which is about. 10 20 minute drive you can probably hear the rain actually um and see what's there it's not a very big town it's probably more like a village and then probably come back in the afternoon and use my laptop um in the cafe which is just down there so that's probably the plan but yeah i will decide in the morning depending on the weather if the weather's really bad i think i might just go to the cafe because um i've seen quite a lot of where i'm staying at the moment and i know it's not kind of the last time that i will come here so i'll have a chance to see other places again um and i am pretty knackered so we will see um but yeah the rain is very very heavy as you probably can hear but yeah all good so far and today's been a really nice mixture of relaxing and resting as well so really enjoyed that